It was a defining moment for South Africa and for Nelson Mandela, a rugby game in 1995 that united the nation. The incredible story was brought to the big screen by actors Morgan Freeman and Matt Damon in the critically acclaimed movie Invictus. Here is the real story. This is how Hollywood portrayed one of the greatest moments in Nelson Mandela's extraordinary life. I want to thank you for what you have done for our country. Well, oh, Mr. President, thank you for what you have done for our country. The 2009 Clint Eastwood movie is Invictus, starring Morgan Freeman as Mandela and Matt Damon as the captain of South Africa's rugby team that unified a nation. Brothers, sisters, this is the time to build our nation. All of the whites are cheering for South Africa. All of the blacks are cheering for England. How long before the World Cup? Don't get your hopes up. We're a damn disgrace. I've been invited to tea. Who? The president. Tell me, Francois, how do we inspire ourselves to greatness when nothing less will do? How do we inspire everyone around us? It was a great moment of national unity, of national togetherness, um, which, which Mandela just quite magically brought about. John Carlin wrote the book the movie Invictus is based on. He interviewed Mandela three times about the momentous rugby game when South Africa won the World Cup in 1995. South Africa was divided between blacks and whites, and Mandela had been the democratically elected president for just a year. He was just quite brilliant in, in using um, the emotions of sport to reach people's hearts. Mandela decided to unite his country through rugby, a sport beloved by whites and despised by blacks who considered the team a symbol of arrogant white rule. When Mandela walked onto the field at the World Cup final to support the mostly white team, the entire nation went wild. And when the South African team upset heavily favored New Zealand, both whites and blacks were bonded together. Here is the actual moment when Mandela congratulated the South African captain. And here is what it looked like in the movie. When you talk to any South African today and they will remember exactly where they were when that game took place and because it was much, much more than a game. Morgan Freeman was handpicked by Mandela to play him in Invictus and released a statement calling him a hero to all who treasure liberty, freedom and the dignity of mankind. And the moment he united a nation will never be forgotten.